Hello, this is Geeta Prana. It's been a long time since I've made a video. And I'm making this video because I'm about to go on vacation. And then it will sit and sit and sit and I'll never make it. And it's about to become winter here in New York. And this is my fall junk journal. So I'm wishing everybody a happy 2016. And without any further ado, let us go forward. Uh, this junk journal is 9 by 6 and I think it's almost 3 inches wide. Um, this was an old cover that I made about a year ago and I haven't known quite what to do with it. Um, I probably won't describe what all I did. Uh, I put some cheesecloth on some decorative paper to make it look like, what do you call that? Um, fancy kind of wallpaper. I forget. Anyway, I used um, mostly uh, some papers from the Bow Bunny Enchanted Autumn collection, some random Graphic 45 papers. I made a lot of my own. I have some downloads of Alphonse Musha posters from Junk Mill and some bookmarks from Hapchit Creative and I'll post those links. So let's go in. Here's the fun page. Here's a tag. I'm doing this through the camera lens. It's really not easy. And this paper I made from an old plastic bag, putting down and then ripping it back off from some, what do you call that? Um, molding paste. And it left this wonderful texture. Sorry, the light's not good. Uh, I have to make this now or I'll be interrupted. And so there's lots of shadows. It's early in the morning. Use my die cuts. Here is a tag. A tuck spot. When I find another tag, I'll use it for a tuck spot. Here is another place to put an, more tuck spots. This is some tracing paper with a piece of uh, napkin on it. A bag. Did I put anything in it? It's been a while since I made this, so I have no idea. Um, I made this pattern paper using stencils and such. Blank page. Here's a pocket with nothing in it. Mostly I meant this journal to have things that you could journal on either directly on the page or slip things in. It's pretty chunky I think to write on. Another tuck spot. Blank page. All the pages have uh, autumn leaves stamps around them and they're all tie-dyed. Uh, tie they're all uh, coffee-dyed. Here's some nice uh, rice paper with a pattern in it. I forget how you call that. Does it open? No, it's a tuck spot. Another, this opens up. Place a journal and another tuck spot. Sorry for the shadows, it's bothering me, but I can't do anything about it. Another tuck spot, die cut as a tab. This is another tuck spot and a pocket, which I don't have anything in. Blank page, blank page, blank page. Uh, here's one of the beautiful bookmarks from Hapachit Creative, tuck spot. Uh, the other half of the bag, which has one of these graphic 45 journaling cards in it. Leaves stuck in here. This is a um, sticker I got at Dollar Tree on some tracing paper. This folds out. Here's another tag inside the belly band. Nothing on the back. More tags, frames, another pocket. Tuck spot made out of ribbon, envelope. A uh, fancy tag, a uh, musha tag. This beautiful uh, download folds out. There's another tuck spot in here. This is like ribbon strung through the paper, tracing paper. Here's one of those jelly bean soup bags and some uh, tags. More paper, blank. This is a bag I made out of deli paper. 
Another Musha tag. Tuck spot made out of a ribbon. Blank. Another tag. Another tag, but I'm going to leave that one in there. Um, one of these Bow Bunny journaling cards. Another gorgeous tuck spot. This also is a tuck spot. This is a pocket from a download from Graphics Fairy. This is just a little taggy thing. I made this paper here uh, just using stamps and all kinds of sprays. I think it looks really cool. A little envelope in the middle, which I haven't uh, glued together and I probably won't. I think I'm going to put this one in our shop. So you can let me know if you're interested. Journaling card. More of the paper that I made. This is a tuck spot right here. I've been inspired as always by the incredibly creative women who and men who are on the Facebook group Junk Journal Junkies. Tuck spot using a die cut fan. Yeah, I made this paper. Here's the leaf tuck spot. It goes in like that, made out of my leaf die. Tim Holtz. I love this little fox stamp. A lot of the journaling, a lot of the papers have things that I placed on the paper when I was coffee dyeing it, so they have patterns on it. I don't know if you can see it that well. The other half of that bag, some journaling cards. Another tracing paper. Gorgeous. I use, I've had this, uh, I went, even, you know, 40 years ago, I had this poster put up in my room when I was a teenager. Some homemade washi tape. And I believe this is another pullout, and this is the envelope. It has some things in it. Here's a little rice paper envelope and note paper blank. Some more um, tuck spots. Here is another tag. Graphic 45 paper. Another tag. Here's another one of the fancy tags. And a crafty Irina paper clip, which still ha has the tag from the back on it. I won't put that Another fold out. And uh, made out of a uh, old, uh, what do you call that? A ha, jelly plate dyed jelly paper with something in it. Another of the gorgeous bookmark. It's from Half Chip Creative. A napkin paper. Blank. Here's just a piece of paper that slides under this tab. Tuck spot. Uh, this is a pocket. I don't have anything in it. And this is, I have a lot of blank places for people to put things in. Say, here's a pocket for the middle of this signature. This has three signatures, by the way. Here's another tag and um, this little fairy I used wow sparkly powder on this is a market list quite a few in this tab blank here's my little these are let's see if I can show you how they work without getting in the shadow here I got this uh, idea from I think it was Jen McGuire and you pull out and you can write a little note in there Holds up like this, and they all come in these little squirrel photo corners in an empty pocket. Uh, I think the pocket was given to me in a swap by um, Cheryl, who's Deli Girl 61. Another jelly bean soup bag, and another homemade paper. This is the front of it. Another tracing paper. Another jelly bean, I mean, deli paper pocket. This is another um, paper clip. 
Let's see if I can take it off. I don't want this to get too long. That I made using a punch of leaves, leaf punch. Another deli paper painted. And another graphic 45 insert. And these cutesy little uh, turkey um, stickers I made into a paper clip. I just, they were so cute. I couldn't walk by them at the store. Another tag. It actually will go like this, and it's pretty when it does that, but of course it can't stay that way in the journal. And that's it. So I hope you enjoyed watching it. Um, again, I say have a wonderful 2016, and I hope to be back soon.